reward based part. She's. I got it! Oh god! Suck my nuts! <laughs> Why? Because I was right. Oh, oh man. my gosh. I love and hate that I got that right. I can't even tell which one's what, actually. Alright, so we got guard versus guard. Who do you think I wins this? I don't know. I'm trying to figure out what's who's who. I personally think it's 60 40 guards' favor. <laughs> I personally think it's 60 uh, 40. Yeah, you think it's 60-40 too? Yeah, if like Gardevoir can't get in on Gardevoir, but once Gardevoir's in, you can't get out of Gardevoir. But I mean, look, um, Yuta does a really good job of playing a close-range Gardevoir, which I actually really like that about his Gardevoir. Oh wait, you were being serious? Yeah, okay. yes I was. <laughs> okay, I thought you were just joking. <laughs> no, Yuta actually does play a, a more close-range Gardevoir when you watch him play. Well, yeah, no, I noticed that. I thought you were just joking about like, it's a matchup of 64 <laughs> whatever. I mean, I think, I definitely think uh, Up Close Gardevoir wins the matchup against Long Range Gardevoir. I mean, especially since Up Close can throw stuff out uh, as well to keep things set. Also, switch the names. Okay, I couldn't even tell who was who. So I'm actually surprised long. Utah's playing a more long range oh, game here. I see that play with names. Which is something I'm not used to seeing him do. That was probably what, what Queen was whispering in Tyler. Like, I was telling him play. Oh, just to do the ditto? Yeah. Ooh. So that was really good because the counterattack ended up uh, stuffing out and uh, delaying uh, it coming down. So he was able to avoid the counterattack. She was able to avoid the counterattack from Utah. Yeah, and using Burst to get uh, Queen away. Queen lo looked like she was getting some pretty good damage when she was up close. Yep. I was going to say, she's definitely going to pop that win that, uh, not whimsical. To get rid of the 8Y spam, but Ooh. that was a bad decision. It was way bad. Or jump Y spam, not 8Y, my bad. It's alright, only round one. Yeah, Queen, Queen was doing a pretty decent job. Um, I think she focused... I feel like she doesn't do as well up close as Utah. She was trying to get in a lot she more than not. Utah was. She can't get in, but she has combos in. Yeah. Like, she has I think trouble getting in. I want to see her try and play just a little more patiently. Like, she could have been more patient there. She should have, like, shielded probably a little bit before, maybe went for a grab or delayed the attack. Because Utah was just ready to counter that. Yeah. Nice burst, getting away. I think, yeah, she's just trying to create, like, a pressure opportunity. Yeah. Like, she was trying to go for the grab. Oh, oh. Yeah, that was a hit. bad she, spot yeah, to throw that out. Bad. Okay, that was. Oh, uh, see, that if she had still had burst, that would have been a good spot to try and use burst. It would have because uh, Utah had already blown his opportunity. But she's holding it really, really strong this round. Nope. Now she's gonna have to try and play patient and avoid getting the same thing done to her. Ooh, counter the counter and yep. to a grab. That's definitely something you'll see Utah do a lot too. Like he'll, he'll usually like slide grab or he'll counter grab. I mean, he's like me. Just oh my gosh. She should be able to block oh this. My gosh. No, no, she did. She, she did. I saw that she hit a button. That's why you like this. It's all right. She still got another potential two games to try and bring it back. She does. But after that, she probably feels. But uh, I wonder. I wonder if she went guard because she doesn't feel confident in Scizor in the matchup. No, uh, she's either gonna go Scizor. Which, I don't know. I feel like. I feel like Caesar God of War, I feel like that's in God of War's favor. Caesar. Uh, I don't I feel like it's in guards. I definitely think I feel like it's in God of War. I think Caesar has a hard time getting in if the God of War decides to play uh, keep away. Because um, I just don't think Caesar is fast enough to get in on somebody that has as many projectiles as God of War has. Yeah. So that makes it really difficult. But we'll see if she can do something. I know she knows... I feel like she knows Scizor a little better than she does Gardevoir. So. Okay. And I also think she's more comfortable with Scizor, even if it is a worse matchup. So that could also play into her favor if she can snag a... If she can at least snag around, I think that'll give her a little bit more momentum. Yeah, playing a character you are way more familiar with and more comfortable with is definitely... Ooh, nice. Like, there you nice go. Guard. No, not, not, sorry, sorry, counter for that. That was really nice. But playing a character you're more familiar with, you'll be able to just that, flow more so naturally. So, Caesar does have that benefit that, um, ooh, ooh. Teleport. don't think I like that U-turn, but bullet punches are really good against range, some of the ranged characters. Good patience. And I feel like, I feel like she has enough time to, to try and grab there. Like, there's nothing Utah can do if she, if 
she would have decided to just grab. Her. Yeah, and then Kyle could have just because Gardevoir's Gardevoir's counter attack is so much slower than uh, some of the other characters in the game, and I think Caesar's grab is fast enough that he should be able to abuse it. That was a nice counter, but she keeps on going for way yeah. Too many wake up grabs. grab is definitely not a good choice here, well, oh. especially because Kyle's getting used to it. Ooh, that was a nice counter coming out from Utah. So normally, I don't like U-Turn, but I feel like U-Turn might be good against the air counter from Guard of War. Ooh, she nice should have held shield. She held shield. Ooh, See, there we go. Oh, she wasn't expecting it, though. Oh, sweep wasn't fast enough to take it. Guard of War is just like... Slap. Yeah. Guard of War keeping her pin pan slung, strong there. Slung. Slung. Just like... Yeah, so she's gonna want to definitely keep her game up close. Has she, did she use swords at all last round? I didn't um, see any. She used it when she U turned that one time. And that's what she did. managed to U turn out and uh, use two swords for that. Ooh, that was a nice counter. Yeah, I do think she's. That was definitely risky, point. but. It ended up working out in her favor. It really did. That was really risky going for the swords there, but it helped her out. But too bad she just wasted. Yeah, that U-turn was a bad idea. Yeah. I don't think she had any reason to try and U-turn there. I think she was more expecting. But Utah's also doing a really good job of like trying to to force out all oh. of her options. Did you just see what happened? There? Yeah, Quagsire. Quagsire is a little bit annoying to deal with, especially if you drop shield and try to do anything else. That was a nice, uh, nice dash grab. And she is threatening Utah right now. Yep. There I was going to say, Utah didn't want to press anything because he, she could have easily pushed his burst in response. So it was either deal with grab, lose the round, or get bursted, lose the round. Yeah, so he was in a really bad situation there, especially with only having one HP. And then, So I feel like she does feel more confident in this matchup. Oh, yeah, you can tell she's playing much more confidently. She's taking much more risks. That was a really smart counter right there, by the way. Ooh, like she too many wake-up grabs. Too many. Utah definitely has that knowing that she's going for it. Ooh, and she's almost gone already. Ooh, Ooh this might be it. Yeah, that's no, close. Did she bring it back? No, oh, that was grab. a really smart uh, counter-attack dash cancel by Utah there. Kyle showing why. He is the guard of war. And why he likes to play as a cabbage for some reason.